Geology in a jiffy. What's in the bag? It's... The carbon cycle. Carbon, having the symbol capital C, is found here on the periodic table. It's being modelled as a black ball. The carbon cycle is a process that cycles carbon about our planet Earth, into it, out of it, and within it. But how can we start explaining the carbon cycle? Think of carbon in this carbon cycle. A wheel looks like our clock, and time starts at the top. So let's start there, at the top of the carbon cycle. Carbon loves an oxygen atom. In fact, carbon doesn't just love one oxygen atom, it loves two which all then bond together to make carbon dioxide, or CO2, which we find as a gas in the air, in our atmosphere. Using sunlight in the process of photosynthesis, plants absorb carbon dioxide. After death, plants can undergo burial, which, over millions of years, can compact to form fossil fuels, which we burn for heat and light. By burning them, in the process of combustion, maybe in a factory or a car, this in turn releases carbon dioxide back into the air, so completely cycling the carbon atoms. That's amazing! We know that plants absorb sunlight and carbon dioxide during photosynthesis, which animals then use to feed upon and eat. Both plants and animals carry out respiration to make their energy, which in turn releases carbon dioxide back into the air. The plants and animals at the end of their life can die, and so could decay, which also releases carbon dioxide back into the air. The processes of plants and animals respiring and decaying also forming a carbon cycle of their own. Wow! It is not only land-based plants that absorb carbon dioxide by photosynthesis. In our seas and oceans, plankton absorb carbon dioxide, and carbon dioxide is also used by organisms to build their shells. These may be ultimately forming limestone, which humans can then burn, to make cement, a process which releases carbon dioxide back into the atmosphere. Volcanoes are also a natural means of adding extra carbon dioxide gas into the atmosphere. But how can I remember all of this? If we think of our Jolly and Jiffy logo, it is a circle. So by placing our first cycle upon it, then adding the other processes, then the limestone, and finally the volcanoes, we have the carbon cycle. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye.